this video, I'm going to show you just how easy it is to create an immersive visual experience using Govee products. So I hope you enjoy this walkthrough, and as always, let me know if you have any questions at all. The first thing you'll need is one of their immersion kits. I'll be installing the DreamView T1 on my 65-inch TV. The package includes the LED lights, welcome materials and instructions, controller, power, mounting clips, orange pads, camera, and alcohol wipes. Now you can certainly install this while your TV is still mounted, but to make things easier to see, I'll take it down. The first thing that's recommended is to use the included wipes to clean the surface. Next, I'll be installing the LED strip around the edge of the TV. You can then use the included clips to provide extra reinforcements at the end of the lights as well as to hide the connector wires from sight. For attaching the controller, a couple things you need to take into consideration is where your outlet's going to be as well as making sure the wires from the camera and the LED strip will be able to reach it. So if any of you are wondering what TV wall mount I have, I'll leave a link in the description for this one. I've had it for about 5 years now and I highly recommend it. Next, I'll be attaching the camera to the TV. Now this can be installed on the top or the bottom, but just make sure that it's directly in the center. The last thing is to place the orange calibrating squares on your TV at the seven indicated spots. These will be removed shortly, so don't press down very hard at all when attaching. Let's now get everything set up. At this point, make sure your camera and lights are connected to the controller in the back and that the controller is plugged into your wall outlet. Go ahead and open up the Govi app and click on the plus icon near the top right and search for backlight and select product H6199. Give the device a name and then put in your Wi-Fi password. The app will walk you through the quick calibration steps, which is essentially you telling the camera where the orange squares are. And once this is done, you're all set. So now that it's set up, I'm going to show you how simple it is to add other devices around your room to create a beautiful immersive experience that will all be controlled by the camera. To get started, click Movie Watching Dream View and select Add. Give it a theme name and make sure the Govee camera device we just set up is selected and then hit the yellow check mark in the top right corner. Now we can begin to add additional devices to our setup. Click the plus icon and find the first product you want to incorporate. I'm going to go down and select my Govee Glide. This next screen allows you to tell the camera approximately where in your room you'll be setting up the new light. Since I'm going to put about three segments of the glide right here on my mantle, I'll be choosing five for the location. It's that easy. The camera is now sending data to the glide to automatically display whatever color is on this side of the screen. Now let's add something else. Click manage the device and this time I'm going to select my Govee floor lamp. So I'm going to have this in the right corner of my room and since I don't want it to be too overpowering I'm going to have the bottom four segments of the lamp turned off and have the top two set for again location five. The camera will now be sending data to the floor lamp on the right to mirror the color that is again on the right side of the screen. And finally, let's set up one more item which will be the hexa panels. For the location of these, I'm going to go with 20 which should allow them to match whatever color is being displayed in the middle of the left side of the screen. So the point of this video was to introduce you to Govee's DreamView feature and show you how simple it is to set up and completely change the dynamic of any room. I've been playing around with this now for about two days, so from here on out I'll play some of my far too many favorite examples, starting out with some more Tron Legacy.